guys, it's Mandy. And John. And today John has a Power Rangers review for you. Alright, today we found um, at Kmart, um, mm -hmm. because they are... Chair mobiles. They are closing up, so they have all of their toys on 20% off. Woohoo! Uh, Gold Ranger stuff is really hard to find in our area, I don't know about you guys, but... Um, so we found the Dino Cycle that comes with the Gold Ranger figure. Um... He's actually the last figure I need for the set. He's not as detailed as the ones that you buy in the separate package, and he comes with a different weapon, but oh well, beggars can't be choosers, and at least he's a gold ranger for my shelf. So. Well, and we the cycle, tried to get a gold ranger. We attempted to get a gold ranger from a certain ordering site, and uh, they, they actually emailed me after a few days and told me that they couldn't fulfill the order. So. After taking our money. So that wasn't too cool, but... Um, so we were happy to find at least So we were at least one. happy to find this one, and that way if we can't find... The other one, then we're good, and we're trying to avoid spending too much money on the, uh, Oops. on the uh, oh, internet wow. for for these for one of them. But whatever, like I said, this is one, and it comes with the cool Dino Cycle cycle that's part of the Zord Builder collection. Cool. So pretty cool. Let's open them up. It's got some cool uh, a cool image of the Gold Ranger in the show on there, and then on the back, it's got. A cool image of him riding uh the bike doesn't look exactly like the one that he comes with i think it's a different bike um but uh oh so he's more yellow in the show there's uh uh there's a few different bikes that you can get uh, all of them come with different color rangers um and we have the dino charge megazord we have another review you can go back and take a look at that one um like i said it comes with the ranger uh a weapon for the ranger um, and then the, the, the cycle actually breaks up into two different, uh, little, um, zords, I guess you would call them, um, like mini zords. So, alright, let's get them opened up. I see a lot of ties in there. Yeah, we'll need these scissors, that's mm -hmm. for sure. Alright. Step one. I like the little cedary, uh... Yeah. Backings that they come in. Uh, most of the Dino Charge stuff has come with that, so it's pretty neat. And Ooh, watch your fingers. You can probably clip it down there, yeah. There's that, and then the Gold Ranger. Oh, let's. Yeah, that. it shouldn't be too. And he's just kind of like that. Oh, did you want this? Um, no, I don't think I need anything okay. on there. Um, all right, so we'll take a look at the cycle real quick first. So there's the cycle. It comes with a a green half and a blue half. Uh, I imagine they just come apart. Yeah, they come apart pretty easy. So then you've got the little dino. Aw, he's cute. And then it like looks like he's... Like he's wheel. <laughs> he stands up, but you guys can't really... So, like... I'll, I'll turn him on his side, so that that's kind of how we stand. You just there's even little arms. He's got little arms Ew, in the front there. So cute. And then we've got another dino. Um, oh, it's a little raptor. He yeah, he looks like he might be like a little raptor. His his arms that aren't off of him, they're just kind of detailed on. Oh golly, his little handlebar feet. Um, this part comes off, and that that's oh. the the Gold Ranger's weapon. Ah. And then. There he is. So, pretty easy to put together. It's just, it's got a little slide port there, and then the slide goes here, and then the Zord Builder ports just kind of snap on. And there's the... So easy enough for kids to be able to cycle. Do. Yeah, pretty easy. Um, I don't know about you guys, but they had a lot of Power Rangers motorcycle stuff when I was a kid, so we'll set that aside for a second. We'll take a look at the figure it comes with. Uh, now these, um, just like any Power Rangers, if you guys are into Power Rangers, um, the ones that come with the motorcycles, what's that? That's a pretty color. Yeah, this is a really good color, um, but, uh, the ones, the, the figures that come with the motorcycles are always all, uh, a bit less detailed than, uh, the regular Ranger figures. Um, for instance, I know the, the regular one probably has a two-tone gold, this is all just kind of gold, which I actually like a little bit better, mm -hmm. um. And, uh, you know, this would be a little more detailed on a figure. You know, I'd have all the paint in here. Um, the the pterodactyl symbol would be a little different. But other than that, I mean, it's got his little wings detailed on. That's, like, a big thing in the show if you guys watch it. Um, he's got both of his 
uh, shoulder pads. His helmet's really detailed. That's a good part about it. And uh, he's the same size as the as the action hero uh, ranger figures from Dino Charge. Cool. So uh, he's actually pretty cool. And then um, normally he has uh, a, a big uh, sword that's his his weapon. Uh, he comes with this. It's a it's like a blade. Um, he's less articulated than a regular ranger. But again. He's still articulated. When he, yeah, he still has some articulation to him. Um, just a lot less uh, detail and a lot less mm -hmm. uh, articulation. But to stand him on a shelf, if you're just a, a shelf collector like me, then he's cool. And, uh, I mean, the, the blade kind of fits in his hand however way you think that, whatever way you think it looks best. Um, but at least he has some sort of a weapon, so he fits in with the rest of the rangers. And I'm sure you could use the other ranger weapons that you have with him. So, let's take a look at him. Right in this thing. Vroom. Looks like the the little dino's arms are his footrests. And then he's got his hands just kind of stay in that like motorcycle riding <laughs> position. Oh, so they just slide on? They just you know, snap on, just kind of if you're like if you're putting the weapon in his hand. And then there he is getting ready to ride fight away crime. and <laughs> you know, fight some evil space aliens, I'm sure. Um, Cute. Now. Uh, real quick, since we got a little time. Um, oh, and also, he for safekeeping his uh, his weapon, just kind of plugs in right there. Oh, you know. So, um, let's see. And then the 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 one leg of the dino is kind of a kickstand, so it'll stand up on a oh, shelf cool. with him riding it if you want. Put it like this, so you guys can look at it um, a little bit more. Real quick, um, just. Oh, yeah. To see how the Zord Builder parts work. Um, <clears throat> you guys probably remember, um, the if, if you guys watched it, the, the review of the Dino Charge Megazord. He's a little big, so he's kind of hard to fit in the frame. Um, but all the Zord Builder uh, toys, they're, they're labeled Zord Builder. Um, and they, they can add on to your, your Megazord, which is kind of cool. Um, they have little ports... Uh, that look like this. Oh, so you can plug into like... Yeah, and just real quick, I'll show you guys. Um, so there's like a a port there and then the the opposite port. And they can just kind of plug on and make... If you want really cool shoulder pads. Yeah, like you can just add, you know, it adds a little bit of an interesting sort of look. So everybody can have like their own... Yeah, you can kind of style them your, your, your own way. That's cool. Um, the bikes, I believe... And now, of course... They changed up the uh, the packaging a little bit and how they, but I believe the Zords, um, I think the arms come off and you can use the bikes as sort of an extra arm, I believe. Really? Yeah, it, it, I mean, it, I don't know, it kind of, like, it fits like oh, that, wow. but... I mean, I mean if kinda... I played around with it a little bit, I would be able to... It does look kind of cool, though, like that. Um, maybe if we take this part off. I don't know. Um, there's, and then see, like, that That way you'd have two ports, so you might be able to fit this on a certain like, way. You could have, arm on both sides, or... Yeah, there's probably different ways you can do it, yeah. but um, I'll have to play around with it. But just so you guys, you guys get the idea of what I'm talking about. Um, Pretty neat. So, uh... Very versatile toy. Yeah, and then the cool thing is, is... Um, any toy that has a Zord Builder, um, label on it for Power Rangers, so whether it be Dino Charge, or whether it be, um, the, the last series that was out, which was Megaforce, or all the way back to when Power Rangers Samurai was oh, out. even I can um, do it, so you know it'll be easy for your kids. They, uh, <laughs> uh, they decided... To do this whole Zord Builder thing, and so you can you can use their Dino Charge stuff with your Power Ranger Samurai stuff, with your Mega Force stuff, and then next year they've got Power Rangers Ninja Steel, and I'm assuming that those will be Zord Builder too. Um, some of even the the high end uh, Legacy figures hmm. um, that that are from the uh, the original Mighty Morphin series, uh, some of those are even Zord Builder compatible. So they're really cool, and it's kind of fun to make your own Zords. Um, yeah, and. Uh, I think it's a neat touch that the that the bikes um, can can kind of attach to. They kind of almost give them the, the Megazords like a Transformers sort of looks. Um, 
But uh, mainly this was bought because we needed a Gold Ranger, and he's so hard to find that... And he was um, 20% off. Yeah, and 20% off. Uh, doesn't hurt. Certainly didn't hurt. And uh, I got an extra cool uh, Power Rangers bike to put on my... Uh, yeah. To put on my shelf. So, um, I'm overall pretty happy with him. I, the only thing I wish uh, for Gold Ranger... Um, I like the way he looks, uh, even though he doesn't have as much detail as the Action Hero ones. Um, I just wish he came with his regular sword instead of the, the, mm. the special sword that he... Uh, comes with on this. I, I just that would have been a nice little throw in that probably wouldn't have cost that much money yeah. to throw in. But um, other than that, I'm, I'm happy with it. I mean, he's got his morpher detailed on, um, which is also one of his weapons in the show. And then uh, the blade, I can I can live with that. I mean, it's just you know at least it's something, and at least it's a gold ranger to to have a uh, the sixth member of the team. So overall, I'm happy with this guy. And uh, you know, if you guys like Power Rangers, make sure you give us a like on this. Yep. Yeah. Give this video a big thumbs up if you're a Power Rangers fan. Comment below with what your favorite series of Power Rangers has been. If you are, you know, a big follower of Power Rangers. And don't forget to subscribe and tell your friends because when we hit 100 likes, we are doing a big giveaway and you don't want to miss it. So thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys real soon. Bye!